Ladies and gentlemen, we are oh we are joined right now by the one and only Nini Music. How are you, Nini? And thanks for being here. We appreciate yeah, it. Oh yeah. Thank you. I'm very good. Hello, everybody. Uh, I'm so big. The screen. I'm so big. Because <laughs> you're our guest. You're our guest. We want you to to be. Uh... Oh my God. So <laughs> Nini, if if people don't know who you are, can you do me a favor and introduce yourself? Let me know whereabouts the world you are. Please plug or promote anything you'd like. Okay. Uh, hello, everybody. My name is Nini. I'm from Taiwan, and I play the Chinese traditional instrument. I doing a lot of folk metal music, original one. I also doing the some cover song. Yeah, and. I wanted to share my instrument so hard and my culture too. So I hope everybody uh, know about Taiwan. It's not Thailand yet. Awesome. <laughs> and, and I read on your website that you've been you've been making music for for over twenty years. At, at, yeah, I play twenty three, twenty two. At what point in your in your studies of folk music did did metal become a serious influence for you? So before I playing a, a bunch ch traditional style, but uh, I went to the street performance. I also joined uh, some music festival. I meet a lot of different country musicians, and I feel like I need to do something special. So I trying to actually I trying to many different style music. I play anime song, play a lot of popular music and metal. But I think the folk metal I think is really cool on my instrument. It, it is really cool, and I know. Uh, well, how many instruments in total can you actually play? Uh, one, two, three, a lot for this thing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> a lot. I love that answer. It, do you ever, do you ever find yourself wanting to pick up another new instrument and learn that one too? I actually have a one instrument. It's kind of new for me. This is a new instrument I have, uh, but the tuning actually just same like my Chinese traditional instrument. And this one is like, it's a weapon, you know, it's like a sword. Yeah, so you kill people. With this. Yeah. <laughs> that is awesome. Um, but it's very different because it's like electric, electric guitar style. I I don't know how to play electric guitar, so I have so many steps need to learn. Yeah. It makes sense because, yeah, you, <laughs> it, it makes sense being uh, an, an unplugged artist and then going electric style and they've got all the pedals and the amps and stuff yeah. like that. Totally it makes sense. It has four strings. Yeah, four strings. Gary, uh, <laughs> what, what's a couple questions that you have for Nini? And by the way, thank That's, you, Gary, for really setting nice. this up. Um, I started following you uh, on YouTube, I, I think it was Megatsune. When you did the cover, it was about two years ago, um, mm. became a Patreon member because yeah. I'm really into preserving old ways. And I just wanted to really, I just wanted to tell you that I really appreciate your you. saving history. You. There's mm. not enough of that that goes around. Mm. And now one other question. If you got an email from Koba Metal and he asked you to do a collaboration, would you? What is that? With Baby Metal. Oh, with a Baby Metal? Yeah. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna, I would do that. <laughs> that would be cool. That would yeah. Be. Maybe we'll have to send him an email. How did how did the the <laughs> Bloody Wood collaboration come out come about with uh? with a giant uh, giant yeah so i i actually this song home then i've been trying to thinking who i need to ask for join my song i actually found the one group from taiwan they are kind of big but i actually don't know what is their english name anyway uh they they give me the price so high is that crazy but i just feel like oh maybe i have a other chance and i saw the bloody wood because they just pop out, you know, and they also is kind of like folk metal, and I really like their 
I owe the music video. So I tried to send them email like, hey, can I doing the music with the singer? You know, yeah. And then he's very nice. He said, yeah, sure, I would do that. I mean, they are very busy because I saw they have a lot of tour and show, but he's still doing, yeah. Mm. Very cool. Uh, is there is there a particular artist or two that you are allowed to tell us about that you would like to work with in the future? I know sometimes some of that stuff's already been set up and we can't talk about it, but is there anything you're allowed to tell us of somebody that you're working with in the future for a collab? Uh, uh, who I wanted to work with? I think uh, the Who. Uh, yeah. the Mon- oh, the Who. Mongolian the Who. One. That would be Definitely. that is a perfect fit right there. That is that a- is my dream because they they are so have their style so strong, and I think if one day I can tour with them, that would be very cool. Yeah. Of all the tours, Mixing modern and ancient is what keeps the old stuff alive. That's my dream. <laughs> of of all the you've toured all over the place, is there? Is there a particular, this is kind of a fun question. Is there a particular food that you found on tour that you'd never tried before that you wish you could go get it again, but it's only in this certain place? Uh, the pho. What is it called? The pho. No, I like it's the the pho from America. Uh, because the pho with the Taiwanese pho is very different. <laughs> I'm not the pho. Is he it's saying pho? P-H-O. Oh, yeah. okay, P-H-O. okay, 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 okay. It's, so it's very different. It's it's probably not as good. I would think. <laughs> it's really good, and Taiwan one is not really good. So ours is better. Interesting. Yes. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> Uh, were you were you surprised uh, of the success of Longma? How how well it's been? Everyone has appreciated and how well that song has done. Did it surprise uh, you that the numbers are yes. through the roof? Very surprised because I doing the uh, I I actually posted a last cover on the YouTube channel, but no, not not other one is get a lot of fire, you know, a lot of view. But this one, I'm, I'm just very surprised. Actually, this song, you know, I uh, when I have a this song ready, and I'm just thinking, like, do I need to put this song on my album? You know, I almost take out, almost. But I just, I asked a lot friend, and then the friend just like, oh, yeah, I like this one. You should put this one. And then, so I put it on the first one, and then have a music video, and then I have no idea how YouTube is working. Just a lot of you. <laughs> That is cool. So, because some people will spend so much time researching the tags and how to word it and the thumbnails, and you just yeah. put it out there, and everyone's like, "We love it! We love it! We love it!" Yeah. That is <laughs> that is so cool. Yeah. Um, Gary, what's another question that you have? <laughs> it, um, how many social media accounts do you have? I have a YouTube, Spotify, iTunes, Reddit, TikTok. Facebook page, Patreon, <laughs> Instagram. Yeah, Instagram. Yeah. We have yeah, a lying. Twitter. <laughs> Are you online? Yeah, lying. Yeah, lying. Yeah, lying. Yeah. What was it like working with uh with Black Worm Instruments to get to get your instrument made? Uh, the they owe you. <laughs> what, what was it like working with Black Worm Instruments though? What does that mean? Because uh, they they built they built this for you, I believe. Oh yes, yes. They <laughs> um that is a friend on the internet, and then he saw me streaming on the Reddit before, and then he said like, oh I I, uh he's making the instrument, and then he said he really wanted making one to me like only one you know. So uh we start talking, and then how I want. So that that. It's a weapon, you know. The weapon is the uh, uh, one god. I don't know if you guys know that god. It's a Guan Yu. Guan Yu, he have a one weapon. And okay. then because I have a the song about Guan Yu, so we just think about maybe the, make uh, the weapon style the ancient. Yeah. How, do you do you know how long how long did you talk to him before you got it? 
I think it's really long. It's like maybe years because we need to prepare and then we need a uh, doing donation for the instrument because you're not making free, you know. Yeah. So sure. I I spend a, a lot of time doing the streaming and then we doing the what is it called? I forget. I got not. Uh, what is that donation F? I forget. Uh, GoFundMe, uh, Kickstarter, uh, Kickstarter, yeah, yeah, Kickstarter, yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, I'm glad you hit, that you were able to hit the goal and get and get it because it looks awesome. Um, yeah. uh, Gary, do you have? Another, I've got like five or six more questions, but if you have no. one or two, go <laughs> no, for go. it. Go ahead. Uh, do you have a favorite movie, Nini? Uh, now, here, here's the thing. Before you answer, before you answer, I like to do yeah. trivia with a lot of the guests that I have on the show. We do not have to do this if you don't want to, but if there's a particular movie that you've seen so many times, you feel like I could not stump you on trivia, what would that movie be? Uh Uh-oh, I don't (laughs) remember the name. It's a ghost movie, you guys can guess. It's a ghost movie and it's very famous and it's about a hotel that have a ghost. And then the most famous part is that when they open a Airbag and I have a blood came out that one. Uh, does anybody in chat know the the shining? <laughs> the shining, yes. That's it uh, with Jack Nicholson. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna look up some easy, easy the shining trivia. I'll ask just one, but uh, Gary, hit me with one more question. And let me look up some shining trivia real quick. Um, so what song are you going to play for us today? Yeah, of course. I will play the Home Men. Oh, good. Of mm-hmm. course. <laughs> yeah. And then what, what, gu- what guitar is that played on? The, the Saxian, the Ruan? Oh, yeah. Sanxuan. Okay. Sanxuan. Nini, do you remember the name of the hotel in The I Shining? I don't know. Do you? If you guys know, I think our friend you will know. Uh, do you guys know the hotel the name? <laughs> if you know, <laughs> let us know. But Amy, if it's okay with you, we'll let you take it away if, you, if you'd if you like to play something for us. Overlook. That, well, Overlook. The Overlook is yeah, correct! Yeah. Yeah. That is correct! She's seen it. She's definitely seen it. <laughs> All right, so we'll bust out a Mad Lib later today. We'll have some fun. But more importantly, Nini, if, if it's okay with you, go ahead and take it away and uh, and go ahead and play uh, whatever you're going to play for us today. Okay. I am going to ready. I can play it out now, right? Sure, whenever you're ready. Okay. <laughs>
Nice. Wow! Thank you. <laughs> it's superb. <laughs> it's so good. So yeah, this instrument, the name is a sanction S A N X I E N, and it means just have a three strings. So actually, it's not very easy to play because this one is so tall, you know, so long. So if I play the do re mi fa so, it will be do re mi fa. You know, the the finger should be very open. How do you yeah. how do you get used to not having any any frets? Because it, it like we always have we have all frets in, it, but this like how no. do you, how do you learn to? It's just memory based on mm -hmm. hearing. You just know. Uh, actually, I have a sound mark here. <laughs> oh, on the um, side. Okay. But but it's very annoying things. If if you change the weird key, they will not be on the notes. The the this point thing here. Yeah. So you just need to follow your feel and then your ear to make sure you push right place. Yeah, it totally makes sense. That's mm. a, is uh, how do you how do you decide what what artist you want to cover when you do your cover songs? Is there is there a certain way you go about deciding oh, I want to do uh, the sound of silence or I want to do this song? How how do you go about when you pick your covers? Because everybody know that song, so I do in a cover. <laughs> so do the really popular stuff. Yes. That's smart. Mm. That's smart. But so I will. I still will choose like a, a lot of songs popular music. But maybe on my instrument to playing is not very well. So I I would just not choose that one. Mm. Makes sense. Everybody knows Crazy Train. Yeah. Right. Thunderstruck. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what yeah. Nini regarding regarding from here till till December the rest of the year. What would you like to accomplish? What are you allowed to tell us that you have coming up? Maybe there's a single or two we can look forward to. Maybe another video coming soon. What are you allowed to tell us? Yes, yeah, so I will have a new original song coming soon. And I will be with uh, one friend who plays the electric guitar. So crazy. You guys need to check out who's him. His name is Jin. And he just <laughs> so fast, you know. It's really crazy fast. So I have a new song with the electric guitar friend. That I think that's the first time I'm with the electric guitar together. And I think the other news is, uh, um, yeah, I just got a Lindsay Starling, the girl who plays violin. Yeah. And then she she will have a summer tour on the Argus, and he uh, she do actually send me message. Can I join the, her summer tour show? So I still talk with her right now. Yeah. That is so awesome! Fun. Congratulations! That is <laughs> awesome. You. That is huge. We love Lindsay Sterling. That yeah, is that I... is big time. I'm happy for you. That is big time. Yeah. So yeah, that's a new thing. <laughs> very very cool. Uh, uh, Gary, I think we've got time for maybe like one or two more each. Is there is there something that you'd like to to uh, end with question wise? Uh, how old were you when you first started playing? Eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yes. So my mom sent me I my mom sent me to the music school, also the dancer school. And uh -huh. then I after I choose the music because my mom say when you get old you cannot dance anymore. So Right. You I can play. still play music. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can you do you do you still dance outside of music sometimes? Mm, no. Uh, no, I don't dance anymore. Okay. Uh, and mm -hmm. then my final question is, uh, Adini, thank you so much for your time. We, we, no, we really so appreciate it. Is I there... have a fun. <laughs> oh, good. I'm glad you had fun. Is there, <laughs> is there, let's say somebody's watching that uh, aspires to to do what you do or, or play the way that you play. Is there is there any advice you could give to to a starting out artist or musician, what would you suggest advice wise? I tell the people who play the music too. No, is it? What does that mean? Uh oh. So so I what I'm trying to say is, um, let's say you have a friend that wants to to start a band. Your yes. fr your friend, but they they don't know what they're doing. Oh, okay. What what would you suggest? I think you need to find the the special way. Um, so I think you need to follow your personality first. 
and then you find the your style. I think this is very important because if everybody doing the same things, you are not special. But like me, I am. Uh, I think I'm I'm like a little bit crazy, so I like playing very crazy music best. You know, that's my personality. So I would just keep going, follow this kind of music, and then show out. Uh, and yeah, you need to be think about something special. No one really doing, so you will make the people to see. And other things, I think is very hard. Actually, this one you cannot change your uh your your mind like. When I before I I wanted to have my dream be tour with the who, mm -hmm. so I just need to keep going doing this, going to this way, you know, need to keep going, not stop or turn the other way until you get. That makes perfect sense. I I love it. Uh, we we appreciate your time. Thank you so much. I know <laughs> that the tour with the who will happen. Just keep doing everything you're doing. Congratulations on touring with Lindsey Sterling. That's awesome. We we look forward to to the uh, the original song coming out here very very soon. But Nini, yeah. thank you so much. Have an excellent day, and uh, thank, thank you so you. much. We appreciate it. You too, and everybody too. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Nini Music. I I need to say goodbye to everybody. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Welcome to the local band, Smokeout.